Hi, everybody. Oh. Hey. Is the phone weird? It looks weird. Did I just do something wrong again? Should it be the other way around? It should be the other way around. You're, oh my it's gosh. facing you. No, I mean, there's you. It's the, oh my God, you guys. Are you Hi. Hi. So, all right. Okay, because the camera's yeah. over there. Oh, you I did it all wrong little, again. You take a little more. Okay. Now I'm looking okay. at the wrong That's thing. The, the best way with their black. Mm -hmm. Hi, you everyone. Can tell by the shape. You can also tell by the surface. I'll show you what okay. we got. I really okay. need to okay. turn this whole thing over. So, this is so that terrible. Here. I can't just figure this out from the get-go. This one. Okay, that's better. Right there is almost. So sorry. So my surgery is Wednesday. Yeah. This is why I'm still you can here. Cut that tip. Okay. I should wonder. Oh, look at this. You know for sure. This is you can cut at least that one. Yeah. Now this one has a long angle. I just started. I know that I was late. late. At I was late that much. Um, Isidore promised he was going to okay. take y'all to the, this one to see the pigs and see how they're doing the pig So I'm going to take yeah. a so small amount. Yeah. Yeah, so I just got back we're going to get Izzy for a little bit today. It's going to yes. take a little bit off there. Hi, Tanya. And if the nail was any longer than that, I would look Hi, at the surface and see. So you've got to read some comments. Like when you're doing the live, Yeah. it would be all common to say cut it. It's like it's all white. I am gonna take it. But the closer you get to the and then you, the more I'm gonna try um, my you best see. to read now, all the this comments. This one was very close. But yeah. I'm not it's very even, good at that. I, yes, starting to be a little bit. Show but me you'll see yeah. that it's darker. Yes, it's the not just coming. white. Mm. So okay. it's gonna look when like you're holding it, yeah. when, when I talk to Izzy on a closer, you know, whenever he's away and I have to talk to him, he does this. So I can see like half of his face. You can't do that. You have to hold it straight. Yes. So All right, hold it the straight. front meal. There's your I, camera. I, 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 already, okay. I you can look into it there. So okay. Take your glasses off. I see um, how much of it see based you. on the curve. Awesome. How, how it much? Like he has a go. Okay. Yeah. He can yeah, squirm. So he's going to feel it. Yeah. Yes. Do you okay. want to do that? No, no, I need and a little more. Okay. Back. okay. All right. Okay. And if you didn't feel anything, then you probably could take a tiny bit more. There's no health checks to do for me right now. Isn't that crazy? This one. You can almost see Hey, I should can. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to take like So yeah, Izzy's going to take you guys to meet and the pigs a in a little, little bit, bit just to help a out bit, a little bit because live. And I'm here it's because my surgery okay. got pushed to Wednesday, yeah. so I could be here today. And you can use, use corn starch um, and I thought, well, I'm not going to take the day off. I'm going to do it. I could have said nothing and just not. Like you can use punch Play like hooky today, so that but I didn't. So, oh, yeah. we got babies. Remember that big girl that was pregnant? She's not pregnant anymore. She said, and we were guessing how many babies she had. But she had four babies. So I'm going to show you that. And Trific and, Trific and Patrick are still the besties. That works really, okay, really well. They're very happy together. Thank you so much. Okay, so, thank you. That's good. How is the piggy doing that had the board on his dog? Isn't that the craziest video? I never seen that before ever. He's doing great. He's all gone. It just loosened and, and came off and he, you know, he's gone. He's eating fine again. But that is definitely that was that was that was weird because I'd never seen that before. Yes. Never yeah. seen that before. But it happens. And that stuff dries so fast, so yeah. But that if you haven't seen that video, you gotta watch it. It's the latest video I posted it this morning. Definitely crazy video. Oh, that's a great picture. Hi! Oh my gosh. Thank you, yes, I'm sure it will. It's kind of routine at surgery, so. The Italian mountains? Oh my goodness, is that where you are? That's so cool. Yep, everyone's here. Let me show you. Yes. Allison's here. Is Amarillo's there in the golf cart? Is cars parked? Alright, let's go for a little walkies. Let's see what's up. Let's 
see what's up. There's a bond happening right now. Hi guys, we're on YouTube Live. Is that okay? Yes. Gracie, say hi. Hi, everybody. So, okay. So, this is their piggy, and this is ours. And she's an older lady, and they specifically wanted an older female. And I think that they are looking very happy already. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they look very happy. They're sharing. They're sharing and they're like, yeah. There's no obvious kind of aggression going on, which is awesome. Because sometimes right off the bat, they can get a little aggressive. But we'll wait and see. But generally girls, it's really easy. You know, they can turn into mean girls. So I like, need know that, that if, even if they're doing great here when you get home mm -hmm. one of them might decide to become a mean girl like okay. I say and what happens is that they'll you know maybe start chasing one will start chasing the other and the other one will run away week 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 like oh my gosh it's the end of the world lots mm -hmm. of drama and that's just kind of normal yeah. okay. as long as they're not fighting and drawing blood that's a different story okay but the chasing and even a little, little tuft of hair in the mouth, then you think, oh my gosh, that, they, that's terrible. And it's actually kind of part of the getting to know each other process. Okay. So a lot of people will call say, oh my gosh, they're chasing each other. And I say, well, send me a video of it. And it just looks completely normal. So okay. I always like to tell people that. Okay. Well, we can handle that. But yeah, they so far, so really good. good. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Successful adoption. Yeah, we have like lots of adoptions, but as usual, it just doesn't seem busy. But on paper, it's so busy. Hi, everyone. Hello. Peoples of YouTube. Peoples of YouTube. Uh, Buddha boys. With one missing. It just doesn't feel the same. Hi, Brew. Hi, sweetheart. Hey, you. Hi. Want to come say hi? Hi. Come here. Come on. No? Oh, fine. Hold in. How are you? Bamba. So I'm still debating who I'm going to put in here instead because we can have another buddha boy and i was hoping that hawk would fit in but hawk has been so aggressive but i, I do want to try him because i can't just put any pig in here because these are all cbs positive so it has to be a pig that already has the calcified bulla syndrome because it is contagious and i definitely don't need another pig getting sick a healthy pig getting it so yeah, I'm very sad about Casanova. It just doesn't feel the same. The minute I reach for the cookie jar, the first image in my head is Casanova. I think about him all the time, like, oh, I'm plucking some grass. Oh, Casanova. And I'm like, oh. Yeah, it's different. It's different. <laughs> All right, hey, big babies. There, there they are. There they are. All four of them. Always. so weird. All four babies. He's so cute, huh? Where's your mommy? Where's your mommy? These are. Wait, did another one have babies? I see five babies. She didn't have five babies. She did? Yeah. She, did. she had five babies? Yeah, five. Wow. Uh, yeah. I only remember four. Uh, one was a group. One week. They've been chasing yeah. me. Look how, how they are running around the cage. <laughs> They're like, what, a day old? Three. Three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I <did>. Two and <laughs> a half. <laughs> an older baby that one I had that baby already he's oh, cute yeah and it's his little little tiny baby 
They're so tiny. Yeah, it's Well, when they have a lot of them, they're usually very small. I can imagine her having five. What a big mama. Five? Yeah, yeah. I've had ten ones. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yep. Ten babies. Uh, and there the, were a few that didn't make it, but then they had a litter of eight, and they all made it. Wow. Eight. So are they lot. smaller than these? Yeah. Yeah. And the mama looked like a plate. Oh, there she is. See how skinny she is now? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's the mama right here. Yeah. Looked like a normal guinea pig now. And here, of course, another big pregnant girl. She was, uh, she was given to us. Someone came to the gate and um, with a box with a boy and a, a girl baby and a pregnant female that he found in front of his apartment complex. You are getting so big. This one looks enormous compared to the new baby. Yeah, she's about to pop. She's big too. Big girl. Yeah, it's, there's never not any pregnant mamas or babies in this nursery. And we definitely don't breed them. <laughs> they come like that. They get, they come here like that. No breeding here. Rach, go on your break. I'm just setting up these guys. I'll go on one. <laughs> okay. Oh, now we're super, wait, gotta get back to normal. Whoa, that was crazy. <laughs> that was crazy. All right, so it's a beautiful day in California. And here's Amaryllis. Say hi. 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 Hola, you know. So, yeah, it's a lovely day. Beautiful. Not too hot, not too cold. All right, let's see if there's any, any work for me to be done. Any work for me to be had? Or are y'all got it under control? These In borders the... were done already? Yeah, they're done. Okay. So, this, I'm okay. So what do we do this morning? I have the one. Four? Oh, make lemonade? Nice. Oh, I gotta go yes. check out what yes. they're doing. And they're yeah, they, when you she's making the, the carrier right now by the American okay. cards. They need the cards. They're, they're gonna have a balance. balance. Okay. So Yes. Can you go around that? Yes. Is that good? Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay, here we go. Horsies! Hi, pretty horsies. Hi, gorgeous. Hello. Hi, Missy. So, Luis and uh, Gabe are fixing the bottom of one of the stalls so we can put the new cages in. Hi, Blake. Hi, Kamara. Concrete. Having to lay a whole new layer of concrete. Thank you, Amaryllis. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Say hi to everyone. Hi, everyone. Look at, Look at that. I can step on here. Okay. Soup. Wow. That's cool. Hi, Louise. Hello. <laughs> wow, that's a thick layer. Yeah, about four or five inches. Wow. How long is it going to take to dry? Uh, one to three days. One to three days? Yeah. Okay. Big job. 
that's a big job. And then we can put the new cages in like these, and the new cages, which are the exact size of a Midwest, the exact dimensions of the Midwest. The only difference is they have a partition in the middle, so if we need and we have singles, we can close it off. But uh, bonded pairs go in here and they have exactly the same size, the same amount of so a space as the Midwest. So that's why we have to custom make these because they, they come smaller if you get them, you know, if you don't do them custom made, they, they, they're a lot smaller. Oh, wow, look at that. Okay. So Izzy is gonna do a little tour for the the pig pig. So I'm just gonna go back. I'm gonna walk back. Hi, baby girl. Hi, baby girl. Hi. What a sweet horse. Yes. Hi, Blakey. You're looking so handsome. You're so handsome boy. Yes, you are. You're a very handsome boy. Yes. He's... Ow! Okay, dude. I did that to myself. He didn't bite hard. He likes to nibble. Did you see that tattoo when he put his lip up? That is his racetrack tattoo. <clears throat> they tattooed them. They don't do that anymore on the lip, on the, on the top lip. They don't do that anymore. Yeah, they're bonded, they're, they're besties. Um, but that is how you can identify a racehorse. You have to flip the lip and then you have to read the number. But sometimes it's really hard and you have to just, you go into the database and then you gotta see if you're missing a number, you gotta put every number and see what comes up, if the age and the color matches the horse. It's really hard to identify, but now they're all chipped. So there's no more guessing. Because we had some uh, unidentified thoroughbreds, the, 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 the two had faded and we just couldn't tell who was who, who was why. She brought her grapes. Yes, I found some. Oh Here, my goodness. Put it up. All right, this is like a Saturday tradition. And you're the first to taste it. I have it, tell me Ooh. if they're any good. Mm. No, oh, very sweet. Oh, good. Very sweet. Yummy. Is someone helping you? Okay. You're welcome. Okay. How about checking out those babies some more? Yeah. Let me go set you up for babies. Look how busy it is in here. So I think, correct me if I'm wrong, but if you have a bigger view or then a very small view, it's it's more fun, right? Because I know I, I, I like to s set people up to watch like a real close area, but maybe it's more fun to see it from a bit of a distance. So you can see more of what's happening. These babies are all over the place for this age. They are so, they're trucking around. How is that? How is that? Sorry, Mama. And then if I put it here this is perfect right let me go put stuff here for them to eat okay we were told by the previous rescue that he is really dominant and that's why to keep him alone. 
No, I'm always so baby. These little monkeys. It's so precious. Yes. A precious baby. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can reach here. I'm sorry. Let me show you this little monkey. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hi, little baby. Hi, baby. Hi, little one. Hi, little one. Go eat. Go num nums. Okay, I think this is a good angle, right? You want closer. Oh, here comes the swamp cooler. It's like took away some of their hideys so you can actually see them. A little closer? Okay. Is this closer? Oh, that's not the same. Okay, it's so hard to... No, see? It's either all or nothing. Sorry. So you're gonna miss half of what's happening if I get this close. And there seems to be no in between, so. You see this one yet? I don't think so. Or did we? Hi, baby. Hi. You're orange on one side, like your mommy. Yeah. <laughs> Thinking, what am I doing here? I gotta do a photo, a little photo shoot with mommy and the babies. Oh, thank you, Cher. So sweet. The two faced Baba, yeah. Yep. And then, of course, I like this baby. And he's a big baby now. He's a big baby. Yeah, you are a big baby. You're a super big baby now. Yeah, you are. Let me see, were you a boy or a girl? It's a, oh, it's a, it's a boy. It's a boy. It's a baby boy. Yeah. Very pretty baby boy. I like to kiss their bellies. Your little baby bellies. Okay, a little closer. There. Better, huh? Okay. I'll be back.
So this lady just got adopted. Hey, Annie. Hi, Annie. Her name's Annie. She's an older lady. Okay. Are you all stealing food and dragging it away? Because that's not what you're supposed to do. No, you're supposed to eat it here. So we can all spy on you. Looks so empty without their Heidi's in it. 
Come on, little monkeys. Oh, there's a little baby. Because there's mommy. Oh, they're both nursing. Isn't that cute? I know she's nursing somewhere. They're both nursing. She's a puffball. Who's sitting on a baby? <laughs> Tiny. Oh my God. Well, she had five babies, wow. so they're really, really small. That's Meanwhile, Donna is trying to reach down for one. Well, also alive. Yeah. Hi, Galileo. Does the live one come home with me? Never seems to. I'm sorry. I'm gonna block the baby oh, camera real quick. Galileo. I love him. He's my little baby. Okay. That's it for a photo bombing. I thought it was Get funny. Some, uh, hand sanitizer. Mm -hmm. So we don't spread. go from cage to cage. So each time you pick up one from I the cage. I love Galileo. Yeah. His head's in. Is it? It's right over here. Such a baby. We just gotta show him off again.
he's still munching away. Anybody for a cookie? Cookie, anybody? No, I just got scared and then you realize that my hand was there. Hi, sweetie, you want a cookie? Okay, your guide is ready. And his name is Isidore. Izzy for short. He promised he'd take y'all see the pick picks. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get the octopus legs out. There. And this is his friend Pablo. Hey, how's it going? Actually, I gotta turn around so we can actually see you better. Hi, Pablo. Hello. Pablo is from Spain. I am indeed. But he speaks British. I well, British isn't the language. No, language. I know. English is English. the language, however. And American dialect in some places is considered a dialect. I mean, American English, excuse me. Yes. Not American dialect. How'd you get so smart? <laughs> He's obviously a soccer fan. Yes. A la Madrid. <laughs> Madrid. Si. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to take you guys on the tour. Let's begin. Yes. Yes. So we're gonna go this way, and I'm gonna. Yes. 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 What? It's sunny. Yeah. I'll take it off when we're in the shade. Don't worry. Yeah. Yes. Yes. All right. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Yes. All right. Now, let me show you guys where we're at. All right. Hold on. So, got the whole setup. As you guys know, on Saturdays, it's pretty cool. We continue, got all the stuff out here, people waiting for appointments. Uh, health checks, say <laughs> hi, wave hi. Yeah, awesome, awesome. This is where we have the vet come and whatnot. We got a little dog bed for her, her little teacup doggy, the tractor, you know? Sorry, sorry, I need to, I need to answer more questions. I'm sorry, guys. Not, not the greatest. All right, we're going to the pigs. We're going to the pigs. They're coming. But first, horses. Horses first. Maybe, maybe. So yeah, I'm not, I don't spend a lot of time over here, but I, I don't know exactly which horses these are. Some of them, are they're, they're all rescues, so some of them like have some trauma and can be kind of mean, so. I try to I try to stay away sometimes. But yeah, they're cool. We take care of them, we love them. Oh yeah, you can hear Weed Whacker in the back. He's going off. He's going off. He's just behind Random right here. So Random, I don't know if you guys know about Random, but we got him um, from like a livestock auction and he was a He was a wild horse. So he's still pretty wild. We can't really can't really touch him and we have Dakota who's the exact opposite super nice super like one of the nicest horses we have here for sure for sure so we'll come around these are our horses we got Blake right here and we have camera right behind with the white face super beautiful very nice horses very nice hi Blake Bye. Super nice. Camera as well. She's got some beautiful eyes. Look at that eye. 
and then oh, Blake's in the way. The other eye. She doesn't really want to do it, but yeah. Beautiful horses, awesome. Pablo and the horse, yes. Now back over here, we got a new pig. He's sleeping right now. Hi Annie, we have Annie over here. Say hi Annie to the live. Hi people. Yes, she says hi. We got this new piggy over here. Hi buddy, sorry to disturb you. It's okay, no? Okay, I'll leave, I'll leave, sorry, sorry. Yeah, I, I, they told me the name the other day, but I, I'm really terrible with names, so I forgot. But this one's really cute. Kind of looks like Ponchi. It has a very small little snout in the face. Very cool. But yeah, lovely pig. Oh, Hannah, yes. Thank you, Avery. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm terrible with names. Very terrible. Yes. All right, now, on to more piggies. The ones that are awake, we can cuddle with. First though, we got the turkey. Now, we rescued this turkey as well from a livestock auction. He gets really aggressive, very aggressive. And at one point, the, the coyotes we have, like all around here in the, the land around, attacked one of them, not this one, attacked one of them and killed it. Um, and then this one got attacked by a coyote one time lost part of its wing and then I was sitting outside one night and I, ha I heard a noise and I ran out here and turns out the turkey got attacked by like a big raccoon or something so now we use this cage in the back to like keep him safe at night and yeah yeah truffle 85 Tur turkeys are very aggressive he he was really nice to me actually a little bit like when I saved him and whatnot but I he, he seems to have forgotten that which is kind of unfortunate, but it's okay. We still love him. We take care of him, even though he is kind of mean, but it's okay. Oh yeah, you can hear Reed Whacker in the back. He hears us coming. I don't know this horse's name either. Uh, I'm not very versed in many of the names, but yeah, I'd, I'd, if I don't know the horse, I try not to get close because I'm, I'm very scared of, I'm not scared, just more safe and cautionary. Yeah, so now we're gonna go say hi to Peppy. What'd you say? Yeah. Yes. Now, on to the fun bit. We'll be able to spend some time with Weed Whacker too. He's over here causing a ruckus. Ah, this is very helpful. Yes, thank you. All right, you wanna close that? Cool. So yeah, we got Pepe over here. Yeah, we got Pepe, and then Elizabeth is cuddling with Panchi. You can see Panchi's very nice. Oh yeah, Panchi boy. Oh, he loves it. He loves it so much. We got Pepe, Pepe. Pepe boy. Hi buddy. Pepe, come on. Come on. Come say hi. Come on Pepe. Yeah, he's, he's really big, so I, I don't like to get very close if he's in his little area. It's his space. Yeah, but let me let me try and get some treats for them. Yeah. Oh, Panchi really likes the these tree leaves up here. If you want, I'll just like pick some and give it to him. But he really likes it. Yeah. I don't know so much about Pepe if he likes that or not. He's kind of... He's kind of picky. But yeah, alright. Let's go. Let, I'm going to go get some treats now. We're going to feed the piggies. It's gonna be a fun time. Rubbing a pig belly. I know what I'll be doing. Yes, yes, they're amazing. Tai Chan. Yeah, Weed Rocker definitely likes to know if people are around Stephanie. He's very, very vocal, very vocal. Yeah. So it's been really nice weather-wise recently. It's not, right now it's not too hot. It's, I would say like a, a cool mid 70s here. So it's pretty nice. We're not dealing with too much crazy heat yet, but I have a feeling in the next like two weeks, it's gonna start picking up. Yeah, Weed Whacker only has like three friends. He's not very 
very cognizant of that. Sorry, I don't, I don't mean to. Okay. Crusty nipples. Uh, we have a, a video about that type of stuff on YouTube, um, Job 3, if you want to check that out. It's pretty uh, pretty helpful, actually. A lot of the YouTube stuff, I have friends from all over the world that actually find it um, very useful and whatnot. Okay, this. Horse tuna. What's a guinea pig's favorite pasta? I don't know. What is it? Uh, we Rocker kind of does when this predator is around. He kind of alerts us. He's just more loud. So if he's going off and it's kind of like darker or something, we know it's not. Um, there's something up essentially. For sure. So I got this little bell pepper. We're going to go give to puppy. Oh, 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 sorry guys. First time really operating the live. Yes, yes, we do have a guard goose here. He's pretty, uh, my room is right next to him, so occasionally he just likes to be really loud really early in the morning. Um, but after, most of the time it doesn't bother me. I'm pretty used to it. Yes, yes, Truffles, he is definitely the head of security. The turkey wishes he was, but he's... Unfortunately not. Yeah, buddy. Sorry about that. Yes, uh, I thought it was funny. I have been doing... I, well, I'm in between movie work right now. I'm getting into stunt driving. So, like, driving the cars and, like, making them skid around and stuff. So, I'm actually, um, like, getting... I'm, I think I'm starting on the 15th, so very soon, very soon. But yeah, should be fun. All right, you want to help me with this again, Pablo? Yeah. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Yeah, it's pretty fun. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. Peppy, I got a treat for you. All right, piggy time. Peppy. Let me... Okay, let me... Okay, right, let's, let's set this up real quick for you guys. Let's see if we got this a decent angle here. No, I don't think so. Yeah. All right, Peppy, go on. I got the treat for you. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, Peppy. Come on. Over here. Come on, Pep. Come on, buddy. Come on. Don't say hi. Yeah, good boy. Yeah, I got more. I'll, I'll, I got you. Uh, sorry, buddy. Yeah, he's he's real big, so I try not to, to bug him too much. Hi, Pepper. Hi, buddy. Yes. Yeah, good boy. Good boy. Yeah, he's not very cuddly like Bunchy. Not very cuddly. More of a a big boy. Yeah, he's really big. Uh, Rins, uh, my mom had some sort of uh, uh, like pinched nerve or something. So she has to get some surgery for it. Oh yeah, you guys can see you got this puppy crust on me. All right, I'm gonna jump this because this is chained. Chained, so all right, Panchi, coming over. Coming over. All right, I don't know if you guys seen an aerial view of a pig, but here you go. They're pretty long. Pretty long. Let's see. Punchy. Hi, buddy. Hi, Punchy. Yeah, he's real nice. Punchy's super cute. All right, Punchy, come on. Come on, Punchy. Punchy. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Come on. All right, now, these trees right here, they can't really reach this stuff, but found out the other day. Uh, that Ponchi actually really likes this stuff. And Ponchi, unlike Peppy, is super soft when he takes stuff from your hands. Like you can almost put your hand in his mouth and he 
he doesn't bite you. He's super nice. Like he he just kind of like his teeth hit my finger and he didn't it didn't hurt. Such a good boy. Yeah, you are punchy. Yeah, I haven't spent much time with Hannah, so I don't really know how she is. But I hear she's really nice. That's what everybody's been telling me. So that's good. I'm excited. We had one pig a while back that was not very much, not very uh, nice. He kind of got mad at everybody and wanted to, wanted to just bite everybody. I don't know. But yeah, Panchi, enjoying those leaves. Yeah, he does have quite a mohawk. Look, he's, he's kind of styling. Yeah, Panchi. Then we got Weed Whacker in the back. Yeah, punch it. Oh, it's just, he was lying down. It's not like, yeah, I can fluff it up if you guys want. Yeah. Yeah, look, here we go. Punch it, you're styling, buddy. Yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah, okay, punch it. Come on, roll over, buddy. Roll over, come on. Give me that tummy. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, see he's super easy. He's super, super easy, he loves it. Punchy boy, he'll even like move his arm for you. He's just the best pig. He's literally, he's like a dog essentially. He comes into the house, super nice. He loves it, he's literally a dog. Just a, a big cheek doggy. Yeah, punchy punch. Punchy, punchy punch, yeah. He's a good boy. He loves it too. Oh, oh, sorry. Yeah, punchy boy. Look at these little, little hoofsies. Hoof. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Cutie pie. Yeah, he's awesome. And then he's gonna be like, hey. Bunchy. Yeah. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Yeah, he likes to come into the house. Or like, run into the yard and then get into the house over there. It's definitely, it's called quite the nuisance, actually. Uh, me, and, me and Gabe aren't very big fans of the pig coming into the house because he He's got a dirty snout and he puts it everywhere and it's, it's kind of difficult to clean. So, we don't like it, but my mom loves it. And it's kind of fun to be like, oh God, the pig's coming in the house, like hide the food. So, it's definitely, definitely interesting. Not everybody can say that they got the, they got the, the pig in the house. The favorite pasta is pigatoni. Oh, I like that. I like that, it's awesome. Very awesome. Yeah. It's pretty funny you never came up with that. Yeah, it's a good one. Pablo thinks it's a good one too. Yes. For sure. Great. So yeah, if you go here, I'll show you the chickens too. They're all kind of over there actually, back where we just were. But I'll give you a little, a little tour real quick. See how close I can get to Weed Whacker too. Let's see. Hopefully, hopefully he doesn't bite me, but I don't think that's gonna happen. I think he's gonna try. Let's see. As we approach, oh, we got another chicken. She was just bathing in the dust and in the dirt. Hi, buddy. That's our rooster. She just walked away. Hi, Goosey. Goosey. Hi, buddy. Yeah. And the other chickens are running away. But yeah, he's pretty, pretty loud. Yeah. Yeah, if we let him out into the yard in the morning, it's just like very loud all morning. So we try not to let him out until at least like 11 or 12. Because then we get some peace and quiet in the morning. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, I thought it was funny. We were on... Uh, the local news station here in LA um, for like a brief like five minute segment about guinea pigs so we went there and I was just like holding a guinea pig 
and whatnot. Um, yeah, so Rin, all of the chickens in Weed or Weed Whacker do get locked up together. Um, we have a big chicken coop if you want to show you real quick. It's pretty cool. It's on the side of the house, not really in the back with everything. But we also have two groups of chickens. So we have the the goose over here, essentially. Let me show you real quick. So now let me get a little closer so you can see it. Yeah, so we have the goose and the arch our side of the chickens over here, like in the front of the house, essentially. And then in the back, um, where Luis and Amaryllis are, we keep the other chickens. So yeah, this is the coop right here. It's pretty decent, pretty big. We got a lot of space. We do have a lot of squirrels. Um, yes, Weed Walker actually does come in the house. He really likes the couch. I don't know why he likes the couch, but occasionally I just hear him in the house. And like, as you guys were hearing outside, he does that in the house. So it's, it's, it's a lot, it's, yeah, it's a lot. <laughs> Definitely a lot. Oh, hi, Athena from New York. Sorry, I almost missed that. Yeah, so we got we got quite the menagerie, as my dad likes to say. Um, many animals. We have a plethora. cat too. Plethora. Yeah, that's a good one. Plethora. Um, multitude. Multitude. Yes. Or uh, perhaps. Um... Now I'm all up. Yep. Oh yeah, no one's in the coop during the day. No one really wants to be there. Unless the gate is closed so they can't come into the yard. That's when they're mainly there. But otherwise, otherwise, yeah, we just kind of make sure they're all, um, they're all inside at night. Otherwise during the day, they're not inside. Hello, I'm doing the live. Hi, live. Yes, say hello. Gabe is here. Yes. Yes. Uh, I thought she was outside. I don't know. Oh, it's here. Okay. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah. Bye. Cool. Yeah. Yes. Gabe says hi, everybody. He doesn't really have the time to to say anything at the moment. Sorry. Hold on. All right. Now we're back in the front with the. Guinea pigs and everything. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, chickens, are, they do need to be out and about for most of the day. Pablo actually does have chickens in Spain as well. Yeah. Um, they're not as loud and annoying as some of my chickens. No, but, mine are much better. Yeah. But it's just because it's you, is he, and the world has decided to pick on you. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes it happens like that. Yes. Hello again. Hello. Back to the back to this. Oh, everybody want to say hi to the live? Say hi. hi. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Fun times. Fun times. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't, I don't know where my mom is. I don't really. I can't exactly be in the garage, so I'm just gonna kind of do another round, answer some more questions. Oh, feral chickens in Hawaii. The guinea cat, yes. Yes, I, I have seen some feral chickens around. Actually here in LA too, in some of like more of the inner city bits, we do get quite a few chickens that are just roaming around and whatnot. And um, it's very interesting to see actually. Yeah, so here actually, I think... No, no, Pablo's chickens does not have a goose. They only have chickens. Only chickens, yeah. All right, here we go. We're back. Hello. Did you do good. I think so. I think we had a fun tour. I answered some questions. I saw some of it. Yeah, I did my best. We had Punchy on his tummy for a bit because you told me I forgot. I wouldn't have done that without your prompting. Um, yeah, I showed them some of the horses. I told them I don't get near some of them because I don't really know them like that. So I'm not exactly. So yeah. That was a fun tour. You got close to the goose. Yeah, we got pretty close. They kind of turn away from you, like. Yeah. He, like, well, I, I kind of corral him away most of the time anyway, so he so kind of like... like... he sees you, he's like, oh, I'm out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Unless he comes up to me, then, then, yeah, then there's an issue. Good job. Yes. Mwah. All right, I love you. I hope you guys had fun. Thanks, Pablo. I will hopefully see you guys soon, next time, maybe next Saturday, who knows? Next Saturday, because then I probably will be up. We'll see uh, how I feel. Okay, yeah, we'll see. We'll see about it, but yes.
Thank enjoy. you. Enjoy. Yes, Bye -bye. enjoy the rest of the life. Bye, guys. Bye, mommy. I'll see you later. Okay, leave yes. us. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Yeah. The black. All right, so we have a full house. They, are they here for a bath? No. Oh, oh okay. Just, 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 like, Let's check out some of these health checks here. It's up to the mom. I mean, if you want to run off and do it for her, it's up to you. So, okay, let's talk about what we have on the table here. Syringes. Right, I'll just finish the rest These of the syringes. Q-tips. Yeah. Gloves in two sizes, medium and small. Tissues. We go through so many of these. In fact, we should have some on our um, Amazon wish list. And maybe one of the mods, our wonderful, lovely mods, can maybe post a link to that. Because we need lots of stuff, always. This is olive oil that we use for the ears or for if it's a really dry pocket, we will use that. This is our big bottle of ivermectin. Are you sure, man? Then in here, sure. and this gets a little dirty because it's outside, but here's our neosporin. This is what we use a lot. This is our um, fungal cream. Here's another fungal cream with no top. We can probably chuck that away if you would, Annie. Thank you. And of course, our CBD that we use all the time, which is amazing stuff, especially if you have seniors and they start to slow down a little bit. This will put a little more pep in the step, as I like to say. Are you struggling there, Annie? I am. <laughs> is the pig not cooperating? No. <laughs> Piglet, let me talk to you for a minute, Piglet. It's okay. It's okay, Piglet. Yeah, it's okay. Um, this we sell in our, sh in our store, on our store actually, on LA Guinea Pig Rescue to come, the CBD. It's under pain relief. And this is actually a little bottle that is, we fill it up. We just use it because it's a nice little bottle with alcohol. So quick spritz on the hands. And of course we have our big sanitizer here. We always disinfect everything after every pig. That's, that's our sanitizer in our little rag there. And then what else? Swamp cooler, of course, because it gets hot, so it's on right now to keep everyone nice and cool, including the pigs that are waiting here to be seen. And they're all being handled right now. These are Valerie's famous grapes. I don't know how long are now. <laughs> mm. Heat stroke kit. Yeah. We have this out because, fortunately, when it heats up, we get people brand piggies that are in the beginning stages of heat stroke. And Valerie is feeling for stones. She's got like some really pronounced little lipomas here. Oh yeah, those are lipomas though. I used to I used to think these were stones and then I had them x-rayed but then nothing ever showed. Yeah. Here. So that's okay. how you learn. No stone. Yeah. You're good. Oh I had a big one yesterday. Okay. Uh, it, yeah, I couldn't take it out. It was too big. Uh -huh. It was. So, it was. It must have been this big, oh, um, and it was like kind of high off. But um, so I thought I could take it out. But then once I actually felt it, it was just this huge bump in between my fingers. I'm like, you're gonna have to unfortunately go to to the doctor and have Piggy put on there completely to do that one because it becomes. Mm, you know, very minute work because they gotta take, you know, they gotta break it up then. It is so beautiful. It's so pretty. Good baby. Yeah. How are you doing over there with your big one? He's almost done. Ears cleaned in the Ivermectin. Did he even have 30 years so young? I always do it. You're wasting time then. I never do it unless they're dirty. I actually wipe, swipe them with my finger first to see if I see anything on it. If I don't, then there's no need to clean it. It's clean. Okay. <laughs> I just saved you some time there. Especially when they're that, when they're that little. Mm. They didn't really get a chance yet to, to build up any, okay. any stuff there. No, healthy pig needs to be rest here. Healthy piggy. Okay. Okay, I, I always love showing the Buddha shrine. That's the green Buddha with this, this is tourmaline, pieces of tourmaline. And I don't know what that one is. It must have some, oh, wait, someone wrote on that. 
something I see. And spoiled rotten piggies live here on the rosemary bush. <laughs> and then we have a bath going on there. And then Elizabeth is going for an adoption. We got it from here, actually. Rambo, was he a baby? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> he's so young. Uh, what's his cage is saying right now? Um, he's in the. Uh, yes. Four by three? Or is it? Yeah. Perfect. That's, yeah. that's great. The minimum size is a two by four. So let's find one of those baby birds. Yeah. Okay. So I really would like them to let me let, let me go to the let's go to the baby boys guys because we have a lot of them and they're getting big and I don't like that too much because they you know they get bigger it's not so easy to have them live in a community so Grimoire who's our nanny boar has a bunch of boys right now he lives with which you know makes him very happy but some of them are getting getting bigger so if they if you take one of the bigger boys it would be best okay. for us. And they become at that age where they, you know, start to become troublemakers. And we have to separate them. And then it becomes harder to bond because when they're young, these little ma the little males, they are so much easier. Hi Grimoire. Hi buddy. Hi baby. He's a heart patient. He's on heart medication. He's an old man. But he's now become our kind of nanny boar pig. Yeah. You got all your little friends. Look at this little snoop, little little skinny pig. Hi, you want to come out and say hi? Hi, come and say hi. Um, I have not hi, can we see you? No, not today? Okay, that's fine. And then we have a bunch of ladies. <laughs> All living together. Order. You just keep Sorry. Yeah, no Sorry. So they love it when you when you when you do this on there. Well, he's looking for treats, but this. So they love it. Oh yes, it's good. He's a little more shy, but oh, he likes it too. Okay, good job. Yeah, he's a he's a real beggar. This guy. Okay, I'm gonna get you a treat. That's Ajax. Love him. All right, treat jar. You know it, don't you? You are just as bad as the Buddha boys. No, not my finger. There. Here, you can have a bunch. You can have a bunch. Hustlers, yeah. They know how to hustle, man. They really do. <laughs> I think they invented it. They're so good at it. Millhouse, you want a cookie too? Cookie? Oh, here, it fell. Here you go. <laughs> Bamba! Bamba? Here, cookie. They're all deaf because they got CBS. Here, come on, buddy. Why are you being so shy? Why are you being so awkward? Come on. Come on. Come on. Here. Cookie. Oh, yeah. Come here. Come get it. Come get your cookie. Good boy. Nom nom. Holman is not a cookie guy. It's just not. You want it today? Okay. Where's Rue? Oh, Rue already found one. Okay. Leave this one in the middle then. Yeah. Good boys. Those boys, the little ones, 
Oh, because he's had something. Yeah. But check his poop now. It should be okay. And he just said that they try no poop on that. Yeah, the previous week had suffers as well. Ah, so uh, okay. So, yeah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. So, yeah, next week, maybe I can rope Izzy in for more help with the life. That'd be cool. That's something he can do. It's just he's so allergic that it's so tough for me to do anything with him with the animals because he can't. He breaks out. But this way. But he was still holding the camera wrong. I could see like this part of his face. He does that always. Want to see the bonding? No, any bonding. They're still deciding on who they like for their friend. I should do a bonding video actually. Males. It's been a while since I did that. You lose power as it's lightning outside. Goede nacht. I will get the time stamps done. Okay, Brigitte, be safe. Be safe. So, yeah, okay, so this morning um, I did the teeth of a piggy that belongs to a volunteer who has those split teeth growing. So, it's just, I don't even know how to describe it because there actually is no word for it. It's where the bottom teeth, sometimes the top, but it's usually the bottom teeth, become thick, really thick, and then start to grow, it splits, and they start to grow pieces. And it, you can get it in varying degrees, and, and hers had actually two on the side. She grew two extra small, thin kind of pieces that were loose, but they I couldn't, you know, they didn't want to come out. So what happens is, is that they bite into something and that then jags that, 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 that those loose pieces into the gum line and it makes them not want to bite into the harder stuff. So I trimmed the top a little bit and then I really trimmed the small pieces really down and made sure it wasn't um, sharp so that now she can more comfortably start biting into like carrots or something. And I see that a lot. Yeah. And um, there, no, there's no name for it. It's really not documented very much. Uh, I think I did a video on one where I actually had to check. He he comes regularly for his trains, this pig, and I have a video on it where it's his top, I believe, and it's, yeah, and it, it, it looks like it, it just sprouted out a whole bunch of, like, different pieces out of his, it looks weird. So... And then I trim him real good as well. So, and then he comes back quite often because he needs constant trimming because it just grows all messed up. And once it starts growing like that, there, there's no fixing that. It keeps growing back. It just comes from the root. So. Izzy did a good job. Well, I'm, I'm happy to hear it. I'm happy to hear it. So they got it all under control over there so I'm not there I can talk to you guys but I'm gonna make it short though because I do need to take it easy and the problem is I've got these really good pain pills now <laughs> which is wonderful but so I don't have to have my head over my hand over my head anymore to relieve the pressure but I overdo it so this morning I was running around getting stuff ready and just like reaching for stuff I'm like man I can't do that because I'm gonna pay for it later so I'm definitely feeling it Ga je weg? Ja. Waar ga je heen? Uh, Erkelop. We gonna go for a hike. Oh, nice. Ja. Yeah. Outside stuff. Yes, outside stuff. Good job. Oké, okay, jongen. Yes, I love you. Enjoy. Doei, doei. Doei. Doeg. Doeg. Practicing his touch. I got a lot of two gym videos. Yeah. So I'm gonna call it quits for today, short and sweet. Well, actually it's been a little over an hour, I think. And uh, I'm gonna see if I can help. If not, I'm gonna just take it easy for a moment. And then I think I should, you know, 
I do the thing on Wednesday, then, you know, I probably can make an appearance on Saturday. We'll see. If I'm over the neck brace and stuff, I'm probably not going to, but uh, maybe Izzy will. I think he will. He just said he would, so. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you all. Thanks, Avery. I, I, it's hard, because once you start feeling good, then, you know, I just, I just don't know how to take it easy, but... But I know I have to, so that's why I'm pulling a quits. I'm going to sit down for a minute, see if they need me, and then, yeah. And maybe a veggie grill tonight. Wow, that would be nice. Such a veggie grill theme. All right, everyone. Well, thank you all for tuning in. Thank you to my mods. Thank you so much, Brigitte, for your timestamps. Thank you all. I hope you enjoyed this short life. But it was cute. Got to see the babies. Yeah. All right, guys. Mwah. Ciao.